Hi, it's Alicia from the Pretty Brown Eye Reader. I have a little secret I wanted to confess today. I am addicted to Kevin Kwan novels. Yes, that's my personal secret. I enjoy Kevin Kwan's novels. Uh, for you that are not familiar with him, he wrote uh, Crazy Rich Asians and another book called China Rich Girlfriend. From the title of Crazy Rich Asians, I was a little taken off when I first heard about it because I was like, ooh, that kind of sounds like a stereotype. I'm not sure if I want to read it. But I saw a couple reviews on it and so I said, it sounds good. Let me, let me try it out. So I read it and I instantly got hooked. It is about some over-the-top rich people who just happen to be Asian. And I think what hooked me, the initial scene of Crazy Rich Asians, involves something um, that I've experienced throughout my life, and that's discrimination. And these um, Asian women are uber rich and still get discriminated against in the initial scene of Crazy Rich Asians. So I automatically clicked with it and I was like, oh, oh, I can, I can identify, I can identify. But as you read on the Crazy Rich Asians, it is just nothing but a soap opera on page. And I love it. I really, really love it. And so I was hooked. I read that book so fast and I just got so absorbed into the characters and the family dynamics and um, trying to find love and who to, who's really your friend when you have this type of money. And I had no idea some of the places they were going. I Cars and fashion and it was being discussed in the book, but it was so fun to me and it was just so much drama. And I love a good story with some drama in it. So, after I got through with that one, I was like, immediately I went and got um, China Rich Girlfriend, which is the continuation of the first book. And it was just even more over the top uh, drama. Even some new characters were introduced. And so, now I'm kind of having, I, I read all that before I started filming YouTube videos. So, I, I haven't discussed them, but I been feeling like I'm kind of going through withdrawal. I understand that Kevin Kwan is going to write a third one because he did not finish all the drama from the first two books. So I'm so looking forward to the third installment of this series. And I just, I just felt like I should confess that I like a series that is nothing but so proper on page. Uh, does anyone else feel my pain? What are some books that you're or series that you're addicted to? I'd love to know. Thanks for watching and have a great day.